I am Reverend Tom Kearns and welcome to 333 Magic 9, your astrology channel. September is always an exciting month. We go back to work, we go back to school, and back to our normal routine. And this September has some special aspects that are very exciting. And here's what they mean for your sign. The month begins as Mercury sextiles Venus on the 3rd. Aquarius, Mercury in your 7th house of partners increases your ability to understand the needs of others. Your ability to communicate clearly eliminates confusion and brings a new direction in personal and business matters. The gentle sextile to Venus in your ninth house of the higher mind brings opportunities to broaden your interest in new ideas, people, and places. Understanding different cultures adds spice and color to your life. So start a new course of study. Saturn turns direct September 6th. Aquarius, Saturn turns direct in Capricorn, his sign of power, and your 12th house of spirituality and personal limitations. You've looked inside yourself to evaluate the deeper meaning of your life and spirit. The world of dreams, intuition, and spirituality has opened you to new realities. Now you must release the ghosts of the past, your fears, and your failures. Use your intuition and your understanding to help you grow in spirituality and power. Venus squares Mars September 8th and then opposes Uranus on the 12th. Aquarius, Venus in the 10th house of status, <laughs> brings depth and passion to your emotions. Your feelings for success are intensified. <laughs> Seek success and recognition through your career and social contacts. But the square to Mars in your first house of personality challenges you to control your need for adventure. You're more impulsive than usual and might overstep your natural boundaries. So please, think before taking action. The Venus-Uranus opposition connects your fourth and tenth houses, setting up challenging energies between your need to feel safe and secure at home and your need to be successful in the greater world. So here's what you do. Leave work at the office and be your loving self at home. One supports the other. Mercury opposes Neptune September 13th. Aquarius, Mercury is empowered in your eighth house of sensuality and renewal. Analyze where you've been successful and where you have failed in intimate or business partnerships and make adjustments. However, as opposition to Neptune in the second house of your resources challenges you to use logic in financial dealings. People may be confused or misrepresenting facts. Read the fine print before you sign and watch your wallet. If a deal sounds too good to be true, you know the end, it probably is. Mercury and the Sun square Saturn on the 23rd and 25th. Aquarius, the son of Mercury in ninth house of the ninth of the higher mind, <laughs> brings energy and new ideas concerning the world and what makes people tick. Travel, study other belief systems, and focus your ambitions on success. However, the square to Saturn in your 12th house of limitations pits expression against responsibility. You must examine how your fears and worries have limited you in the past. Heal them now. These predictions were based on your sun sign. If you enjoyed them, please subscribe to my channel, 333 Magic 9. And if you'd like more accurate information based on your personal chart, then go to my website, professorastrology.com. You can order a transit chart that is good for the next 12 months. Just go to the readings page. Now, I'd like to thank you for watching. I'd like to thank you for listening. Please share these videos with your friends because they are free. 
that's a good price. Again, thanks for watching and I hope you have a great month.